see if we can see on the replay. Oh, what was Eddie doing? Eddie Cheever just pulled down into him. No question. He's on the outside. Cheever had no idea he was there. Pulled right across. Well, he's outside how he, of him. How could he not know he was there? He's alongside of him. Wow. Ooh. That's a huge mistake. And I have to tell you, if I was Marco, I'd have done I'd a little be, more than shake my be, fist. Yeah, I'd be really upset. Let's watch this again. You're on board with Marco. I mean, he's not even close. He's he's clear up beside Cheever. Cheever just keeps coming and knocks him right off the... Wow. Wow. Let's go down and hear from Dad Michael here momentarily. He's not going to be much happier than Marco is, I don't believe. Right after he sees this video. He hits him wheel to wheel. It's not like... Wow. He, he, he just was paying absolutely no attention whatsoever. No excuse for that. The most veteran driver in this race. And they've had their words before, and you can see that uh, they'll probably yeah, have them Because down at St. Pete, one was blaming the other. Chambers out. Everybody's okay. I mean, there's not much question. They're bowling over down here in the Marco Andretti pits. And, Dad, uh, you just saw the replay. Your thoughts? The guy's a waste. You know, he did it on purpose. It's so blatant. I mean, he does it all the time whenever any of us come up behind. A guy doesn't belong out on the racetrack. Complete idiot. What do you do now? What can you do about what happened on the track? What do you yeah, do? I, what do you do? The guy shouldn't even be allowed to be on the racetrack. You know, it's just a shame. I feel so bad for Marco driving a hell of a race, and uh, a guy like that just blatantly takes the kid out. I mean, just stupid. You know, think about it. Larry, l let's look at the facts. This guy is the most experienced driver on this racetrack this afternoon. Yeah. That's not a move that you see from an experienced race driver. Now, he, I mean, I don't believe that he did it on purpose. I, 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 not, I don't say that either. Did, but I think that he really just was not paying attention. He, he'd been getting lapped quite a bit from well, everybody like, else. Like two laps off the pace. Yeah, and, and to not be paying attention to cars behind you, they're really, you know, for somebody that's got that much experience, there's no excuse for that. Well, Larry, is it not true when you're a couple laps off the pace, you have to drive in the mirror? You right. have to see who's going up behind you. I mean, Absolutely. You're, you're out of competition, basically. Absolutely. When you're, when you're running two mile an hour slower than people, you're going to have a lot of people coming up on you. We just saw three guys go around him all in the same corner the lap lap or two before with uh, the leaders and then when Marco catches him and I'm sure not a good day for Mr. Cheever he had two cars crash in the Infinity Pro Series earlier today and now he's had uh, this miscue and uh, uh, yeah. the video doesn't lie a guy with his experience if he were a rookie and that happened that's one thing but not a guy with his experience yeah there's really you can't make excuses for him. And I'm, I don't think he'll make excuses for himself, quite honestly. I think he'll say uh, he just made a mistake. But anyway, yeah, but, but when you're two laps off the pace, just to say I made a mistake kind of doesn't make up for taking a contender out of the race. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not sure what that smile's all about. Thumbs up certainly was not to Marco, I don't think. But. Anyway, lap <laughs> 40, <think> they're <laughs> going to be making their pit stops here pretty soon, and we'll see what happens. I'd like to have one of our RF cameras follow him back to pit lane after the race is over and see what Michael has to say to him. I don't want to be in Or the Mario. They're both going to be in the hospital at the same time. <laughs> it's a mandatory checkup. That would be interesting. Well, I, I said last week the last 50 laps of the 500 would be very entertaining. Uh, the last 20 of this race will be